If things don't go my way, I try to look at it as a lesson. You feel me? So, I get the opportunity to do something. Even if it goes wrong, I did it. And I know now where this road goes. So now it's like, okay, I could backtrack and I could move and I could try some other shit. You feel me? But it's about trial and error. Que lo que, que lo que, little papi de este lado, estamos activos aquí, look really youth, tu me entiendes? Los jóvenes maduros de Miami, conectando. What's going on, how y'all feeling? Thank you, thank you, fire, so then, all right, let's get straight into it. What do you prefer rapping in, Spanish or English? Spanish, bro. It's my first language. Mm -hmm. So, like, I could talk in English, normal. But entonces cuando yo tengo que complicar la vuelta y dar cotorra, I, like, I feel comfortable in Spanish. You feel me? Because I could say shit I can't say in English. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I definitely feel that. And you were born in DR or? It's, a, it's complicated, but it's an interesting story. I was born here, mm -hmm. but when I was two years old, my mom went to DR. Well, me and my sisters, my brothers, we left and... I came back again when I was like 13. Mm -hmm. When I was 13, I came back, I moved with my brother, and then is when I started going to school and like learning the language and all that other shit. But I feel like, you feel me? It's like yeah. both, but but not really. Like I spend- Creating music, you feel like more comfortable with like the Spanish type. Cause I've also heard a lot of the Spanglish, like that's, that's a big question too. Like the Spanglish industry is just growing. You're seeing a lot of artists. Do that. Where it doesn't have to be full English. It doesn't have to be full Spanish. And yeah. that's something that I know you do really fire. It's like a generational thing, bro. I think because mm -hmm. like there's like the generation that didn't interest themselves in like learning Spanish because of whatever you feel me. But then there's this generation that listens to the music that checks out the media there's people that don't even speak spanish i love bad bunny okay like you feel me so it became something that's not just like latin music it's like we're in the game already you feel me like it's not the same one it's worldwide music like reggaeton a bad bunny song can play in a club in miami in a club in italy in a club in Puerto Rico in a club in Africa like everywhere because it's a type of club and like you know just feeling music it doesn't have to do with the people don't even have to know Spanish and they're saying like or pepas pepas how many people you hear screaming that at the club who don't know one word in Spanish at all but they know not one word in Spanish it. but that comes on they know the hook that just shows that music is just it's a language in of itself you know like it speaks through barriers and, and I think that's that's a dope part about it bro to be honest Good yeah. yeah, bro. I mean, yeah, and I feel like the time is coming. Like, things are lining up to where, like, them both artists are getting recognized by American artists. And, like, um, there's collaborations that are being made. There's fucking brands. Cheetos is sponsoring Lion artists. And, like, you feel me? Like, it's, it's, the game is changing. So, everything's lining up to where now I could be like, okay, I could do Spanish. Mm hmm. But if the Migos want to do a record, like I could do a record. Like, what's up? You feel me? Like, I'm in the booth. I got to drop a verse, I'll drop a verse. For sure. You feel me? Even though it's not my area, I could get in that area. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. As long as I'm, like, comfortable. Mm -hmm. And I could do that shit right. Yeah. It's like, palo, palo, palo. And todo el idioma. With everything going well, like, let's say everything works out perfect. Where do you see Lil Papi in the next five, ten years? Honestly, bro, I see myself at the top of the world, bro. Honestly, like, and I'm going for everything. I'm going for everything, and I know that there's people that come after me. That it's not even about me sometimes. It's the people that come after me. The people that see me, that know me from the whole process and from before. Like, yo, this is possible. Like, that's it. That's it. If you make it, Look, possible, like, yo, that's it. You could inspire the whole fucking world. And it's just about giving an impact. Because at the end of the day, money's going to come. That's, and it's going to go too. Thanks. You feel me? And one, when you look at the game, it's like, a lot of the people that you thought were like up here, actually like 
chilling right here, but they look like they right here. Mm-hmm. You feel me? But then when you're around, you notice like the little things, and it's like okay, you know. This is how you move. Exactly. So you learn how to manage it, and it could be like reliable, bro. Like music could be lived off of. You feel me? If you don't focus on like, oh yeah, I'm gonna go a hundred thousand mm-hmm. dollars. What? Sit down. <laughs> be humble. Like so, it, it, being humble is hard in this industry. So how do you feel about that? You know, you see a lot of arrogant people winning, and like most. I mean, look at Kanye West. He's probably one of the most like you know spoken about, yeah. followed, everything, and he is the most arrogant person in the world. Yeah, I uh, feel like it's, it's truth. It sells. This is true, but also like confidence <laughs> could be mistaken for for arrogance in a lot of cases, and I feel like sometimes you earn it. Like I don't want to, but y'all get what I'm saying. You feel me? Like you earn it. You get to a point where like you're like I've worked. Hard enough, I've accomplished enough to where I could be like, yo, world, I accomplished this, I did this. Because it's not like you're talking at your ass. If you're talking at your ass, you're sitting here like, yeah, ooh, ooh, and mm-hmm. just, Kanye could sit here and talk for days. And like, mm-hmm. It's how Soldier Boy, you know how Soldier Boy is always looking crazy? But then it's like, he actually was the first thing to do everything. And he's just <laughs> like, yo. But it's about being innovative. Like, this nigga's just doing everything. And, bro, this is just crazy. That's just fucking insane. <laughs> but I'm in here now. Yeah. So they gonna fuck with me. Whoever, well, both cameras. I should talk about how. Oh, yeah, baby. Little Poppy. <laughs> so let's see. Who are some of the, your favorite, like, artists or producers that you've collaborated with so far? I mean, I feel like I'm a very early stages of my career, you feel me? But mm-hmm. I've worked with very good producers. I've worked with Bravo before, as one of the producers I've worked with, Yambi and a couple of big records, like the Oi. Mm-hmm. Um, I've worked with um, Brian on the B, Zuri G, great engineer, you feel me? He had experience from working with Daddy Yankee and Jay and all these people, you feel me? And also Pinto Picasso. Somewhere from Puerto Rico. I don't know if you know. And I got some things in play. I want to get into a business with a Q, maybe. But that's being talked about right now. So mm-hmm. I don't want to, you feel me? Respect. But, Respect. yeah, I'm I'm working on it. And honestly, I'm open to, like, collaborate. I'm open to collaborate because I feel like that's what it's about. Oh, yeah. We're going to see a lot more little poppy collaborations, a lot more little yeah, poppy yeah. records, you know? Shit, here's, here's another one. What's, like, one piece of advice you give to yourself that you know now, way back then, the first day when you started creating music? Mm. It's closer than what you think. But get your ass up. Mm-hmm. Like, right now. And, like, go get that shit. Like, right now. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's simple, but it's hard. It's just hard work. It sounds easy, but it's just. I don't know how it is. <laughs> no, no, that's a fact. Constant Ooh. battle. That's a real fucking battle. Yeah. Let's see. And it's not even like you get rich and your problems disappear. Your problems gonna get different. You feel me? But. Now you're going to have to be smarter to deal with your problems. So, pros and cons, bro. I feel like it's a balance. But it's like you sitting there and then God like gives you one and then you're like, oh, but this like I asked for this. And this is what it comes with. And it's like nobody told you that this is, that it's known. Like it comes with negative shit. But hopefully the good always the bad at the end of the day, bro. Mm-hmm. That's what we go for. Yeah, that's a fact too. Like, like what are some of like both good and bad, but like some of the most memorable moments that you feel like you've lived throughout this music journey? I mean, what can I tell you? I look at it as positively as I can, always, all the time. Even if things don't go my way, I try to look at it as a lesson. You feel me? So. 
I get the opportunity to do something, even if it goes wrong, I did it. And I know now where this road goes. So now it's like, okay, I could backtrack and I could move and I could try some other shit. You feel me? But it's about trial and error. So, I don't know, man. The best things that have happened to me so far, I don't think have happened to me yet. What do you do outside the music, man? You know? Well, that's it. I got to a point, thank God, right, that like, I kind of try to organize my life like around music. You feel me? Even if it's not like, it, everything has to be with the same purpose, you feel me? So I'm working at the clubs and shit now. You feel me? I was like busting the tables at first, <laughs> then I was doing the signs, then I was um, running the, the bottles and the shit, you feel me? Just everywhere. Networking. Yeah, I was twerking exactly. at the club. <laughs> 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 nah, but for real, like, my bitches, bro, my shit, bro, and just being in the nightlife, bro, just <clears throat> fucking being lit. And feeding off the energy, really, that, like, is in the streets. Because, really, like, the only way to know is not, like, through your phone. Like, yeah. you could go viral today, but if you can turn the crowd up right there, then you're not doing nothing. You feel me? Like, it's gonna look cool, but it's not gonna feel the same, like, no, no. artistically, you feel me? But, shit like that, bro, and I'm trying to elevate, bro, I'm trying to start promoting this event, you feel me? I'm trying to get some things moving, and nigga, hopefully the music starts bringing bread, so that the money that I'm invest back into it now looks different, you feel me? Like, next level shit. Mm -hmm. What are some... Like, let's say you wake up tomorrow, you got a hundred grand right there, budget. No strings attached, no label papers, no loan, but you got a hundred thousand dollars in front of you. Okay. Used to invest into your music career. What are you doing? Well, say, with a hundred thousand, you get a marketing team. They're going to figure out the other half of that. <laughs> and I still got, what, 90,000 left, right? So you spend ten thousand on marketing. Ten thousand on marketing, but on the marketing team is for the start. Yeah. You feel me? The 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 <clears throat> actually like campaigns and the other shit. That's the other shit. Then is the hundred k strictly for the music? No, you could. What other things are you thinking about? It has to be towards you know your artist career to a certain extent. You could be them. investments. You feel yeah, me? I mean, yeah, sure, but not really. It's not saying like, yeah, fuck it, let's do it. Hundred k, what you doing? <laughs> To push the body forward. Alright. So, I mean, first off, the trip to the art, I'll do a media tour, like, across the whole country. I gotta be on every radio station, I gotta be in every club, I gotta be in every TV show, you feel me? At 12, when everybody's sitting at the table, you know, they, they gotta see me on the TV, you feel me? At least if 50,000 got to go into that, then fuck it, 50,000 go into that. But I know that I could sit in six months and that shit's going to hit back like right that. You feel me? And... So you still got 40 days, you got 40 40. Months. I got to get some drip, son. <laughs> How long are you spending on drip? You got to get some drip. Hey. Probably a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Probably a lot, you feel me? I hope God, you feel me, bless me. But, yeah, it's part of it. Yeah, so you gotta it think is. It's an artist you have to play. So how, how much are you putting into the drip then? <clears throat> I don't know, it's looking like the other 50. It depends on how I want to dress. It depends on how I, if I want to dress up Nike, you feel me? <laughs> and some, like, chilling shit, like, okay, I could be fresh on the daily with the Nikes. Or, or, now, if we want to bust some Dior, and we, we looking different. I fuck with that. So you feel me? Pero ya después de eso no está coronado. <laughs> Chacho. Si no, comprar tierra para allá, bro. Yeah, nigga. Hell yeah. Cheap as buy. fuck, nigga. And you know what I like? When you buy land in the yard, you buy it one time. That shit's mm -hmm. yours. No That's taxes it. to nobody. That's crazy. Go. Chow. That's it. You know like They got communities with like 300k houses. And you have like a 5,000 square foot lot. A fat ass crib. Hey, hit us up. Lucrative retirement plans. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a commercial. You feel it? Right there. Good night. Nah, nah, nah. 
Let's see how it goes. Yeah. You want to give any shout out to any anybody? I mean, yeah, shout out to everybody that supports me. Shout out to Lucrative Youth, you feel me? Shout out to all the people that helped me become who I am today. You feel me? All the people working in the background, man, and everybody that listens to my music. Everybody. So shout out, man. Fuck with y'all, because y'all fuck with me. Whoever don't fuck with me, man, it's your problem. Catch up. Stupid. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>